the new skinny crunch cereal is today's food for thought my name is Jodie Munting this is our daily live health tip to help you lose weight by eating well now today we're going to be talking about this brand new cereal by the skinny bars company now just to put it into perspective uh, there is more nutritious breakfast available cereals are not the best choice however if you are going to choose a cereal obviously having one that's low calorie or made of oats is a better choice so this is how you can make smart choices with your cereals uh, so today we're going to be talking about this brand new product the advertising is of course guilt free it's new it's exclusively only at B&M now the thing you'll notice look at the size of my head <laughs> These are very small boxes of cereal for two quid. So again, value for money, um, still things like general porridge oats are better. Uh, but if you want just an alternative, maybe a weekend treat, something like that, which is still low calories, uh, then this might be the choice for you. So we're gonna be taste testing them today. Uh, we'll also be giving you the full lowdown of the ingredients and all that jazz. Uh, so first of all, what really sticks out on the box is 111 calories per 25 grams so that's really important which is why i've got my scales here so we are going to weigh out 25 grams so you can see what that looks like um but before we do that let's go through the ingredients um just a little note as well that protein wise 1.3 grams of fiber per 25 gram um serving which is not much protein 2.5 grams so a tiny little bit of protein uh, to get that protein up um, now let's have a look at the ingredients so the ingredients in this is whole grain eight oat flakes 53 percent which is a good start so it has got oats in there the second most uh, heavy ingredient is sugar rapeseed oil wheat flour crisped cereal four percent uh, wheat starch corn and wheat crispies three percent wheat flour um, maltrose syrup freeze-dried raspberries one percent sweetened blueberries 0.6 percent now when i tried these yesterday i did notice those blueberries and they were so tasty um uh, sweetened cranberries flavorings antioxidants and salt so again quite a lot of ingredients there probably not as much as your regular cereal so that is a, a good start uh, and as we said uh, per 25 gram it is uh, 111 calories now that's excluding your milk so we're going to talk about that a little bit later also on the box by the way the full description this is the berry flavor and down here we've got the chocolate one the full description of this berry granola is toasted mixed cereal clusters with freeze-dried raspberries sweetened blueberries and sweetened cranberries so that is the secret ingredient um, and on the back here it does show you how you can make a little bit of a smoothie bowl as well so I quite like that idea adding fresh fruit is obviously always a good idea for your health um, and these are the skinny bars where it originates from that's who makes it so shall we do 25 grams now i'm doing it in a glass bowl so you can see sorry about that noise that wasn't a very nice noise um so let's have a look at 25 grams of this cereal i'll get it out of the bag so you can see it so it's basically a bit of a copy of jordan's um crunch so those of you when i was 31 so i used to love a whole box of that um, so I've got to be really careful with the portions here. So 25 grams. Now this is the only glass bowl I've got. Oh, that's 26 grams. This is the only glass bowl I've got. It's just embarrassing, isn't it? So this is 25 grams of this cereal. Now who in their right mind would have this much cereal in a bowl. I know a lot of you use cereal instead as like toppers. So granola is quite good to top on top of yogurt and fruit. So I think this sort of cereal probably is gonna be best suited like that. But bear in mind that that is 111 calories. Um, and it also says here there's 15 servings. I know that many of my slimmers would have this sort of size. And 
and that is the whole packet guys so that is 15 servings <laughs> again it's really important that we don't do that and this is where buying these sorts of products maybe aren't for you if you are going to be doing that uh, maybe i'll need to do that off camera okay um, and then the other thing we're going to do is we are going to do the chocolate one so this is the chocolate flavored one just put that there so you can see it um, so this is slightly higher 117 grams sorry 117 calories per 25 grams uh, this has one gram of fiber and 2.6 grams of protein um, and again there's a nice uh, recipe there where you can make overnight oats with it uh, with cherries Ooh, who doesn't love a bit of chocolate and cherry now let's go through the ingredients again on the side of this so oat flakes again 48 percent sugar rapeseed oil wheat flour milk and white chocolate rolls so five percent uh, is the chocolate on this one um, corn and wheat crispies three percent dark chocolate three percent wow it's got two lots of chocolate in that's nice uh, milk chocolate all oh, three lots of chocolate in. Um, grated coconut wow i didn't realize that 2.5 percent grated coconut that's good for health uh, wheat starch, natural flavourings and, and antioxidants and that is your ingredients list on this um, and again for your hazardous uh, information let's weigh out 25 grams of this oh look how chocolatey that is can you see all those nice bits of chocolate so it's literally 10% chocolate I particularly like those rolls look can you see that white and chocolate rolls so let's get 25 grams of this stuff. Now this bowl is even bigger, by the way. Oh. You know, I like to be exact. So, this is a bigger bowl than I've just used. And as you can see, <laughs> that is 25 grams of <laughs> this cereal. Now the good news is, when you have this little, <laughs> I feel so stupid I'm in this point. When you have this little food, obviously you don't need much um, milk either, do you? So let's measure out our milk just for uh, calorie wise. What should we have, 100 mil on this? So this is 100 mil of uh, semi skimmed milk. And, oh, it's just going to have to stay there. Uh, so 100 ml of semi-skim milk is 50 calories, guys. So that's 50 calories on the top there. Um, that's probably too much. I could probably have got away with 50 grams. Uh, bearing in mind, that's 117 calories. Therefore, it's 167 calories for this breakfast. And because it's so small and I want it to last a while, it's definitely recommended to have a uh, teaspoon to eat this with. So like I said about that chocolate, let me show you guys. Can you see that lovely like chocolate swirl? But literally, if you're like me, you like to get a lot for your calories. This is not going to do it for most people. It is tasty. It actually tastes exactly the same as Jordan's Crunch. Which again, is similar price, it's just slightly lower in calories. As I said, I would recommend it. Not every day, maybe a once a week treat. But definitely make sure this doesn't happen. We have the whole box in one go because that is a lot of calories uh, that is almost 2000 calories guys if you have the whole box of these and as i said they're not very big boxes so that is easily done right what do you think guys do you love this type of granola do you make your own granola 
you have the grain-free granola from Marks and Spencers? Let's talk granola. Leave us a comment. Tell me what you think. And if you've tried this, what do you think of it? Are you going to try it? Are you going to run to B&M right now and grab yourself some of this skinny crunch granola? Right. Well, thank you for joining me. See you again next time.